Hello and welcome. Today, Board Crazy is sailing the seven seas and trying to protect our crews of salty dogs. Salty Dogs is a card game for two to four players from Berserker Art, which is still in development. In Salty Dogs, each player is in control of a crew of five animal pirates who are engaged in a battle with the other players' crews. The winner is simply the last player standing. At the start of the game, the crew cards are shuffled up and five are dealt to each player. The players then assign them to their positions. There is a captain, a first mate, and then three generic pirates. The remaining crew cards are then shuffled into the rest of the deck, and then five of those cards are also dealt to each player, and these comprise the player's starting hands. On a player's turn, they draw one card from the draw pile, and then they play one card from their hand. Cards allow players to do things like attack opponents, cure illnesses of their own crew members, and also refill empty crew slots if they have a crew card in hand. There are also defense cards, which can be played on other players' turn to block certain cards from taking effect. Players' crew members get attacked from left to right, starting with their lowest ranking pirate and then going up to the captain. The first mates are immune to mutiny attacks, which means they cannot be stolen by their players, while the captains are immune to both mutinies and illnesses, which means they can only be defeated with an attack. However, once a player's captain has been successfully attacked, they are out of the game, and there can be only one. So, who will be the last salty dog standing today? Let's find out. Okay, so before we get started playing the game, we should introduce ourselves. I am D. I am joined, as ever, by... I'm Graham. And I am Captain William. That's of it? The... That's what you got? Huh? What? Okay, you're gonna cut me off? Fine. Go on. Finish. No, I'm, I don't, I don't want to do it anymore. Okay? Okay, Captain William of the... <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say the name of my ship, uh -huh. but I didn't have anything good, and in a way, Graham bailed me out. Okay. Now, well, um... You just ruined it. So, we should uh, give credit where credit's due with this game before we play. Sure. Salty Dogs It's a game coming to Kickstarter in September. We'll talk more about that later, but for now, I do want to mention that this game is designed by Andy Brown, Sean McCauley, and Phil Cairns. Thank you. So, them. thank you for creating this Thanks, game. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Thanks for sending it to us. And yes, and then the artwork is done by... Uh, World-famous comic book artist, Simon Bisley. Mm -hmm. I hope that's how you say, it, say yeah, his yes. name. It is? Okay, good. We have our crews set up already. Each of us starts with five uh, crewmen. Yes. Uh, I have Handsome Charles as my captain, and I think he's going to lead me to victory. I have I have Ratbeard. Ratbeard. <laughs> Ratbeard. And yeah. his first meet, Mr. Natural. Mm. Does it make sense that a crew of dogs and, and cats and doesn't, horses doesn't would have one follow dog. a rat? Yeah. He's got a sword. My oh. captain is Young Sean. <laughs> when Young Sean is not recording mm -hmm. with Def Jam Records, he pirates a crew. I'm heads of crew of pirates. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we have to choose our first player. There is no way provided. Um, so, what do you guys think? It should be the person who, who owns something. the most dogs. Uh, no, that's not. Uh, who has pirated something? <laughs> Okay. Uh, don't look at me. <laughs> I've always followed the law in regards to pirating. Okay, I'll go first. Um, <laughs> we got to deal with the cards. It. How many? Five each? Five each. So it would be D, Graham, Master Dealer. Me. All right. Is that good, guys? Did I do good? I guess that's adequate. Graham, how many gold stars do I get? Zero. How many doubloons? Zero gold stars. Well, you're up first, Will. Oh, right. Yeah. So I draw a card, then play a card. Oh, yes. If you can. I think... No hand limit in this game, so I'm going for the max. I think I'm going to give Infinity. both H and a doubloon some black spot. Nice. So a black spot was a... Uh, wouldn't you get it in like a letter in real life as a pirate and it would mean you're done for? You're donezo? And then in... Pirates of the Caribbean, you'd get like a black spot in your hand, mm -hmm. which is, let's be real, those movies are masterpieces, probably how it actually happened in real yeah. life. Yeah. Witchcraft and magic. Likely. So, well, I'm going to... No um, exaggeration there at all. No sarcasm either. That's why I said it's so dry. D. Attack. I'm going to do a raid. Okay. So what does the raid allow you to do? It allows me to steal a card from an enemy hand. Randomly select a card. You. Okay, hold, hold you? on. Let me phantom. Poisoned Aha. my monkeys. I thought he was going to choose me. 
Yeah, so you could hypothetically okay. cure. You could hypothetically raid someone's hand to the point where they're down to one, couldn't you? I guess that'd be horrible. Well, I'm going to mutiny. No, 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 no. You're looking at Malcolm Hogg's squad. Let me explain something to you. Do He's I have the, to? Do I have to go after? I have to go left to right. Yeah. Oh, He's I want a Jamal cook, kid. No. He's the kid on my. I don't think the poop deck was like the main deck. I think the poop deck was like a deck that was elevated. You could. I'm just gonna draw. It's where people go to the bathroom. That's not true. It is true. Why would they call it the poop? What, what, do you think the poop deck was named after poop, or poop was named after the poop deck? Named after Captain Poop. <laughs> Captain Edward Poop. Captain Edward Poop. Graham. Have you drawn a card? I want Piggy Peg Leg to walk the plank. <laughs> well. Okay. Oh, sorry, he goes into my brig. So basically, I just capture a crew member and put him in my brig. Most attacks, that's what they do. Some of them are special. Like mutiny and raid. Okay. I... I thought he was going to say something clever. Like, I I'm am to do a thing. the best pirate in the Caribbean. I'm also going to raid again. Graham? Well, yeah, I'm going ocean. All right, fine. to the Kraken. Obviously. So the Kraken can't be countered. So he just Bam. wins. Oh, D. Okay. Oh, wait, I forgot to pick a card there. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. I knew what I wanted to do anyway, so we're not going to worry about that. One of us will probably forget to draw a card throughout this yeah. game anyway at some point, and then we'll have to explain ourselves. Yeah. I had that, but I had that planned out, so I was mm -hmm. ready to do it, and I forgot. Mm -hmm. Graham? Viper do and it. Scratch. Don't do it. I have the black Don't. spot. Oh, you. Fly that going around, I heard. Mm. Black spots everywhere. Mm hmm. What it really is is the plague. Because doesn't the plague show up as black spots? Maybe. Mm. I've only, had, I've only, only ever had the plague once in my life. I've only ever had it once. <laughs> they sent me to Pavalia Island. I got better. <laughs> I got better. Ugh. All right, I'm going to play Elon Tusk. It's a clever yeah. name. Elephant with a blunderbuss, and now he's on my ship. Is the blunderbuss his trunk? That'd no, be really funny. No, he's he had it like in his a trunk. normal trunk. He's holding it with his hands. What are you doing, Graham? You look at my well, hand immediately. That's why I'm glad I got Malcolm Hogswag. Oh uh, no, he's a turncoat. Ha ha! A traitor to my crew. That's how mutiny goes. What? What is? I want you guys to come up with a name for your ship by the end of the video. Okay. So start thinking of it. What was the name of a ship captained by handsome Charles? Be that's called. what I'm thinking. The Chuck Wagon. Boom. Done. The what? Don't even need the entire episode. What's your episode called? I Wait. mean, your episode, your ship. I don't know why I said episode. The Chuck Wagon. The Chuck Wagon. Yeah. It's My not a ship. wagon, though. It's called it the, is now. the Bearded Rat. The Bearded Rat. <laughs> okay, Rat Bearded Ship. The Bearded Rat. <laughs> Giving this a lot of thought. I appreciate it. <laughs> What about yours, Will? <laughs> I was actually going to say my ship is called the Old Sean. The Old Sean? <laughs> <laughs> the Siren. Ooh. On Malcolm Hogswoggler. You don't have any uh, no, I don't. earplugs? No, he's no. back. He's in my prison. He's been apprehended. And he's going to be bacon <laughs> soon. I'm gonna, we're going to eat him. Right. I know that's kind of cannibalism in this yeah. universe, but... Different species, still. Yeah. You can use a cannon... Which can only be uh, stopped by fog. I'm going to use it on Will. On Woody Giambi. Oh, yeah. Gambi. Woody, Woody Gambi. I thought it was Giambi. I actually thought it was like a weird baseball reference. Okay. So I go to the brig. Yes. Give me a Woody Gambi. All oh, right. This isn't good, guys. I think Elon Tusk is about to get the black spot. Oh, no. Dang. If only he had a cure for it. If only. Graham, mm, you're going to get a stowaway. Mm, I was afraid this going to happen. So now what the stowaway does is it blocks an enemy crew slot and can only be removed if he played a siren. Mm. Sirens can actually be used to attack your enemy or remove stowaways from your own ship. I got your back. Well, you can get a stowaway. Nice. Ooh. So, same thing. Now I can't use that spot to replenish. What's your favorite 18th century cuisine? <laughs> I think that you would find on a ship. Would it be salt cod? I, I honestly am not an expert on pirate food, um, so it's hard for me to say. I think Jamal Kidd is going to walk the plank. Wait, wait, wait. Ooh. Rubber dinghy. Oh, I stopped him. Jamal Kidd from having to I'm walk gonna, I'm gonna the just, plank. I'm going to answer and say oranges. Oranges, <laughs> make sure you don't get scurvy. Yeah. Um, or you delicious. could get Piggy's Peg like gumbo. Mm. I'm gonna use the cannon 
on the bird. Not mm -hmm. fingerless Dutch. Fingerless Dutch. No. <laughs> Say goodbye to fingerless Dutch. He's the ancestor of Dutch English. You no, killed no, 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 the no, no, bird. My turn. Oh. I'm gonna play uh, Lady Ivy to replace Fingerless Dutch. Ah, uh, he has so many crewmen. He, he always has so many crewmen. Need some feminine wiles on this ship. I'm going to make Jamal Kidd walk the plank. Don't Wait. tell me you haven't. Get him out of here. He Jamal Kidd, he was the main producer I want to make Sean's shit. record. You know what you've done? Because now that Sean doesn't have his guy to, to mix his music, it's going to sound horrible. Off rhythm. I know. What did it horrible sound good anyway? I'm going to use a siren. Mm -hmm. My question yeah. is, do I want to use it to attack Harry? Do I want to use it to attack Cat Lady? Or There's a couple options here. Or do I want to take away my stowaway? You have a couple options. I don't like the way that Harry's looking at me. Is that a monocle? No, it's no, not. It's not a monocle. He's just a weird looking dude. Don't do it. Don't do it to Harry. Do you have anything to stop it? You have earplugs? No. Harry's in my brig. Dang. Oh, I got a Harry brig shoot. now. Detective Harry brig. Alright, I'm up. <laughs> it's the character in my next novel. Uh, I'm gonna use... Sounds not, it's not a bad character name. Voodoo. To cure my black spot on Elon Tusk. Okay, so Elon is no longer spotted. Oh, this is not good. We've been taking each other out, Graham, with too much vigor. I like it's time it. to refocus. Oh, I appreciate your vigor. It's time to focus on the, uh, what's your ship called, D? The Chuck Wagon. Well, the it's Chuck unfortunate wagon. for Elon Musk that he just got rid of the black spot because he's about to get scurvy. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> you. <laughs> that poor Elon Tusk. He just can't, yeah, he just can't catch a break today. It's not one thing, it's another. He's going to have SARS next. Can't wait. All right, who's up? It's so Will. So I've taken a look at the crews, and I've come to notice that Lady Ivy... It's just too good looking to be on the chuck wagon. She needs to be on the old Sean. Ridiculous. So I'm playing Mutiny. Oh, man. Okay. She's going right into my crew. Right onto the poop deck. Well, I can replace her. Ah, oh, he keeps getting all the crew members. It's annoying. Zheng Shi. Or she. Another female. Oh, no. I have to steal her, too. We could just kill Will. <laughs> Cram! First off, Kill Will. Kill good Will. Good name for a movie series. Should make it. Um, but don't I do think it. don't do it. You guys haven't given me any. Diseases. I'm going to cure. Oh. Oh, he had a cure. I burn scratch. The bucket of youth. The bucket of youth. Who's your favorite pirate? In real life? Yeah. Oof. Well, see, there's a show called Black Sails that's made me really particular to Blackbeard and uh, Jack Rackham. Mm. Um, but like researching real life pirates, I think Captain Kidd. Five, uh, is it my turn? Sean? Like not Did Sean. you just win? You won? I just went. Yeah, okay. Um, Captain Kidd's really cool, and so is uh, Avery. Jamal Kidd? Jamal Kidd, yeah, sorry, Jamal Kidd. I mean, Uncharted 4 players know all these people, eh? eh? Leif Erickson. Leif Erickson? Oh, qualifies a pirate, but okay. D, I'm crackening your new bird. Oh, not bird. What is that? It's like a shit. What is a female? A if that's what you meant. <laughs> <laughs> sort of. There you All right. Go. So there you go. Rude. Let's press pause now. That the who has the most people in their brig? Eh? Let's I, see. I have one. I have two. I have five. Whoa. I'm just taking people left and right. Yeah. Young Sean, don't give no just... f's. He just. Oop. I'm going Steve. to play mutiny. To take back Lady Ivy. Whoa. No! And put her back in her position. You traitor. My favorite pirate, Roberto Clemente. I think it's time Dr. Burry Bones joins the crew. Oh, Burry Bones. Oh, what? He's like an undead. Yeah. That was creepy. That's cool, actually. Undead gator or something? Yeah, it looks like a... Probably an alligator. Oh, I almost drew from this. <clears throat> Don't do it. I'm firing a cannon at Graham's ship. Oh, no. I got a fog. And he fogs He's it. He's got a fog. I'm just going to throw the fog Throw the out. fog out. <laughs> got a fog machine. You're fogged. Oh, <laughs> fog machine. Yeah. Release the <laughs> fog <it> machine. <laughs> the black spot. Those guys are constantly out of commission. Oh, man. That's kind of how it works. The lower, the, the lower down, they don't, they don't get the good treatment that the captain would get. Nope. So black spot's not really a disease. It's like, a, like I said, it's a it's a dirt it's a dark mark. In this game, it looks like a disease though. Chickenpox. What is it? 
The Kraken. Oh, can't be undone. So whoever you're taking. Do you want Lady Ivy or do you want his first mate? And with the possibility of me eliminating him. Oh, you, you fool! Done. You fool! Why would you help him? Because <laughs> I'm about to release the game winner card. Doesn't make this not a thing. He's, he's lying. Don't listen to him. Come on, Will. Guys, I'm just saying, I have another Kraken in here. High spitter. D? I'll attack the other one. I want your first mate to walk the plank. <sighs> Do you have a rubber dinghy? Ouch. He does not. Oh no. Fang Boa. You better get a. Uh oh. You better get another. No, his luck though, he always gets crew members. Yep. <laughs> it's so annoying. The Muddy Professor is in play. The Muddy Professor? Yeah. Can he get fat and skinny and transform his life? Probably. Do you guys like those movies? Which one? One or two? Of the Nutty Professor. Well, guess what? One question at a time, Will. Guess what? I, mean, I remember the first one being entertaining. I don't know if it's any I good. I was always jealous when he opens his drawer and he's a teacher. And Nutty Professor he... was short-lived. He's walking the plane. Are you serious? <laughs> Why are you doing this? <laughs> Graham, thank you for giving me an opportunity. <laughs> Do it. Do it. I don't think he can by the face he's Yeah, made. he can't. Do it. Can you not? All I can literally do on this turn is give Dia stowaway. Okay. There's a scene in Nutty Professor where he opens up a drawer and he just has like a ton of candy in it. And as a kid, I was oh. always like, maybe that's why I'm so chunky as an adult is that I watched that movie and it was like Snickers. I'm going to start hiding them everywhere. I think I figured it out. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. <laughs> it out for me for some reason. Reason that <laughs> he identified a threat. You know, I'm pretty sure we could just take out Will if, we just, if he would just go after him. I got a Kraken. Don't you do it. Zachary Waters is a nice, kind old man. He's never even pulled that pistol he has on his belt. He did. Oh! <laughs> no! So can we all do anything here? All I could do is stow away on D. Oh my oh, goodness. Oh, wow. All right. Jeez. Just kill me. <laughs> Crack it! <laughs> I mean, he has a huge advantage over you. I know. You take me out, you're done. You're done, Zo. That's not true. In two turns. But if I go after him, he goes right after me again. I'll be, either way, he goes after me because he has no choice. I see how it is. So you go after the weak person. This is this is how it always happens. End it. See, I'm too kind for these games. Ah! No, 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 no. It goes to your brain. Oh, right. Graham? Oh, I should not forget this. <laughs> Graham will probably kill me though, so. Graham's an opportunist. Oh, yeah, you can kill him still. <laughs> <laughs> Graham's an opportunist. <laughs> Young Sean getting cannoned. You have a fog. I do not. Oh! Yes! All right. All right. We, we had a good alliance there, but we're pirates. <laughs> it was no alliance. <laughs> I hate you guys. See, that was, I was kind of hoping Graham would do that. All right, I'm going to play. I'm out. A siren. Can you stop it? I can't stop it. Okay. No, 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 that's not, no. <laughs> All right, Graham, you have one card left. Once you can heal. Bellamy Bags, you got him again. Bill Bellamy Bags. Yep. His first name's Bill. And even Sunday. Oh, scurved. Scurvy. You got scurved. This ain't good, actually. You got a cure. You got a cure. Here we go. Cure for scurvy. Boom. Bellamy Bags is back in the game, y'all. This is mine. That goes there. Who's Billy Bags named after, you think? Maybe Billy Bones from, like, Treasure Island? It'd be. You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> he, he just got healthy again. He's like, they're like, look, vitamin C. He's like, no! <laughs> oh, scurvy on me, eh? Yeah, <laughs> the scurvy's on you. Can you do anything? Mm-hmm. Oh, darn it. But can you block it? Oh. Do it. Siren. Oh, yes! he had it. He had it. <laughs> I looked at you. So I looked at your hand, and I saw that you had earplugs. And I was like, if he plays a siren, he's gonna hate this. Oh, now here's the question: Can you stop my siren? I cannot. Yes, I had the rubber dinghy and the fog. <laughs> you couldn't stop I had a the can siren. Of fog? I don't. Oh! <laughs> Dang it! Wait, do you hear? Just boom. Boom. He had it. No. All right. Well, well played. The bearded rat lives on. Indeed.
Sorry, Hanson Charles. I mean, his crew is... That's annoying. You only got yeah. two guys left, and they're both So sick. you were deciding between the cannon and the siren? Mm-hmm. You chose wrong. I did, chose apparently. Because I thought you did, you couldn't stop a siren like another like a turn or two earlier, so oh. I was like... Oh man! I, I picked up I picked up the uh, earplugs like after I got hit by the siren. So I am feeling kind of salty. Give me the outburst table, actually. There you go. That's how mm. I feel right now. It's a good way to feel. I should have won. I like that he's feeling that way. Handsome Charles probably means that I won or something. Again, this game was designed by Andy Brown, Sean McCaughey, and Phil Cairns, uh, with art by Simon Bisley. The art's really good. We'll talk about that more when we have a review, which we'll mention again in a bit. Uh, it's coming to Kickstarter in September. Um, they don't have a specific date yet, but it's soon. So check soon. back in a few weeks and keep an eye on it. Um, the game's oh. going to come in a two-piece box. It's so we beautiful. got it in just like a little, little box, but it's going to come in a two-piece box that includes four uh, play mats and all the cards. Can you get the last card there? Uh, here you go. Right. And the stowaway. Here's some of my guys. Um, and also there will be some minor addition to the rules than what, from the version we had, as well as a few additional cards. Basically, what we played is the product. So if you think it looked cool, keep, like I said, keep an eye out on Kickstarter in September for Salty Dogs. Yep. I had a good time. Yeah, we'll talk more it. about that in the review. Yeah. That's right, we'll have a review of this game coming up on our website, no, on the YouTube channel. <laughs> we haven't had a website in quite some time. No, <laughs> this YouTube channel, next Wednesday, the review will be out. If you enjoyed this video, we hope you did, you can, of course, like, comment, subscribe, uh, share, and click the notification bell. All those things we always say because, you know, in case you forgot that those th were options. Uh, there you go. You also check out our social media. Our Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram are all linked to in the description below. Uh, yeah, but I think that's, uh, that's going to wrap it up. Again, come back next Wednesday for the review. And until then, thank you for watching, everybody. Goodbye. Bye. Oh, what a salty day. I'm very annoyed. Congratulations, Graham. See you, guys.